Yo. We've grown numb to imagery of death and demise. Blind as St. Paul till he saw a Syrian sky miles away. Wars praying on interior styles. Our deaf ears still ain't hearing the cry. Why is it even worth asking anymore? Guilt is but a swinging door. Crooked men on either side cushioning each other's fall. Orphans hiding from a devil with dark wings. And writers with a conscience fill it pluck at our heartstrings. But very seldom do we bother to speak. Led to believe we're rendered powerless by fatherless creeps. Bastardized politics. Tickers while our daughters beseech us to let them flee these borders in peace. I wonder if these sad scenarios will still remain as commonplace when I'm a father. Want to face a law without regrets? I could have tried harder. But on verses, we can all live or die by. See, I used to wish that Allah had taken us both away. Because my life without you, I couldn't stand for one more day. But now I see that I was in over my head. And I just pray for your soul instead. Yo. A generation of our future's parents robbed of the role models and bottling this anger in until they explode on a road to a dead end paved with empty promises told by our head men who fold on any armistice to sell the weapons to finances ever decade and highnesses sir pluses and minuses we're stuck in the rhinos of war torn horizons forlorn surprises of which border to cover and if mortals will smother as if all of the other shit that dictators can stick you with wasn't enough for brothers who live within this conspicuous state so Thumbs, short crumbs can cure hunger, but what are the post traumatic stress a three year old will undergo in Gaza? Knowing that they buck dad, growing up to buck back, like give him his chain, same dad. It's no surprise, never got to hear it from his usra. In the ma'al usri yusra. Now, in the ma'al usri yusra is a very short verse from the Quran which basically says that through hardship comes ease. What else can we tell people who have lost everything in this world? who are surrounded, occupied, and destroyed every day through this hardship that will come ease, inshallah. Thank you all for coming out and supporting. If you have any more money in your pockets to donate, please do it. If you don't, go home, look up these organizations and try to donate when you can. Other great ones to look after or look for are the Jerusalem Fund, uh, the American Near East Refugee Aid, that's ANERA. You got the Palestine Children's Relief Fund, all of these organizations are doing wonderful things down there, so please help out. Please show support and educate y'all. Each one, teach one. Peace.